So, um, hi everybody. I'm Amy Brenneman, and I am so excited to talk with Emmanuel Sippy from Lexington, Kentucky. Um, I'm thrilled to be paired with you because based on your resume, you're just my kind of person. So hi. Hi. It's really such a pleasure to be with you. I actually spent the first few months of quarantine when all my waking hours that weren't organizing were binging private practice. And so this feels like a cool um, coming together, even though we're not out of quarantine, maybe post-election season, just full circle. So it's yeah. I'm a huge fan and it's super cool to be chatting with you. How did you come to this work? I just started organizing really for the community, not particularly because I was like, this issue is, is the issue or I'm a political person, um, but yeah, as I as I came to it and have grown with it, I really feel like I've grown up um, with organizing and the organizations I work for. Um, yeah, keeping relationships at the center, I think that's that's what got me here, but it's also what keeps me. Um, and so I I love the 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 work. Often, I think, and if we're doing it right, feels secondary um, to the community and the relationships that we're building that really have to stay at the center. How would you parse out organizing versus activism versus working on a campaign? Because I feel like what you just, the way you just used organizing is so relational and in an ongoing way, right? It's not like, oh, it's going to be over when the ballots are counted. It's it's a deeper commitment. Yeah, it's a way of being. I think, um, I mean, similarly to, you know, the Jewish world in which I grew up in, um, once I moved here, organizing was just another way of seeing the world, really just like the lens through which you view everything, right? So it doesn't have to be a traditional kind of protest. Um, the last few months I've spent um, organizing, but really through research. Um, and I think if we can push back on this idea that there's only one way, um, that's, a, that's a huge opening um, and, and a really crucial thing. I think you were just speaking to, right, like art as activism and I think that's, again, so crucial and key in propelling the change we desperately need. And so um, amazing to chat with you um, and really appreciate you um, supporting um, young folks on the ground um, and all the, all the work that you've laid the foundation for. Um, and yeah, just being, um, being willing to have this conversation. That is super generous of you. And I feel like, um, I don't think I've ever said this out loud, but um, I'm sorry. Sorry we didn't do more. <laughs> sorry about those fucking gun laws. I really am sorry about that. And I mean that, like as a mom, I'm like, I'm sorry, you've had to, but we're with you. <laughs>